Hello everyone, today we're going to be doing a very special video in MLB The Show 19, one I've been wanting to do for a long time now. I have been investing in potential gold diamonds in the past few months. As you guys can see the top right corner of my screen, I officially have a million stubs in MLB The Show, completely free to play, I have not spent any money on a game this year, and we are one card away from completing all collections. So we're going to be doing that, we're going to be building my dream team as well as my all-time Blue Jay team build. So, uh, of course, I bought 200 Felipe Vasquez cards. So that's how I got that million. He went diamond. So 200 times 5,000 quick sell each. That is, of course, 1 million stubs. Now, as you guys can see, I'm going to go into collections here. Mike Trout is the last player I need to get. Now, his price is up now at 176000 uh, he was hovering around 160000 for a few weeks. So I'm gonna, I'm not going to wait for uh, these prices to go down. I really want to get this <laughs> thing done right now. So 176000 subs so is what we're going to have to pay to get Mike Trout. Uh, I do already have Rogers Hornsby. I have competed in the National League um, a few months ago. And Rogers Hornsby is a very, very good card. But I'm looking forward to get that Yvonne Rodriguez. And, of course, 99 Willie May. So let's put in a buy order here. For Mike Trout, hopefully he does sell quickly. Now, I am doing voiceover over this video. So, of course, I'm not going to go through every order. Wait till they buy. I'm just going to go through over the players. And once they buy, show you my full team. First of all, let's get Ken Griffey Jr. Now, I had sold him when I got him from the program to invest in Felipe Vasquez. Of course, every sub I put in. I got more out of it, so I'm able to buy Ken Griffey back for just over 120,000 stubs. One of the greatest swings, if not the sweetest swing in the game. Can't wait to get uh, my hands on that card and use him in uh, some ranked season. So, uh, over at first base, I'm getting Lou Gehrig, just under 100,000 stubs. One of the best lefty bats in the game. In my opinion, might be the best first baseman in the game. Now, I had struggled a bit with Frank Thomas. I often had hard contact with him, but for some reason, it's lineouts and warning track power. I uh, haven't had the most success at second base. It's a guy that's going to be on our all-time Blue Jay team, Roberto Alomar one of the greatest if not the greatest blue jay of all time uh, just over a hundred and ten thousand stubs now um, this guy took a while to sell to me over the evening i changed my orders uh, i think i got him for about 115 uh, another blue jay here josh donaldson he will be at third base for me had him a, f a while a few weeks and i sold him back for stubs I was rotating between Eddie Matthews and Arenado. Donaldson, my favorite player in the entire league. Very excited to have his 99 signature series card. Now, in terms of pitchers, I am wanting to get Bob Gibson, of course, complete the program voucher with Lou Gehrig and Josh Donaldson to get a few XP and, of course, 30,000 subs back. So that will be able to buy me another card. Uh, Bob Gibson just under 100,000, about 95,000 stubs. A 99 overall righty pitcher. I do already have Kershaw, uh, Nolan Ryan, and Wainwright. I will be getting Cole Hamels as well. And I have, for the time being, Vita Blue. Bob gets in a great pitch selection. Pretty good stats. Excited to use that card. Now, I do want to improve my bullpen, and what better guy to get as the best lefty reliever in the game, Billy Wagner, at uh, about 150,000 stubs. I absolutely love using him. I use him uh, a bit, of course, in moments, and uh, I believe I may have used him in Battle Royale as well. I love his windup. I love his pitch selection. Throws absolute gas. Very excited. So... All right, now let's start to get some guys from my all-time Blue Jay team build, some current Blue Jay, some past Blue Jay. We're going to start off with catcher, a 95 Russell Martin signature series. I have used this card in the past. Uh, I like this card. Uh, he's pretty cheap, just over uh, 11,000 stubs, so a good budget signature series card right there. Uh, of course, we're going to have Fry Thomas at first, Alomar at second, and at short, Omar Vizquel, much cheaper than Troy Tulowitzki, which I could have used. But, of course, Vizquel being only about 30K and a switch hitter with great vision, great fielding, overall fantastic stats. Uh, having him and Alomar down the middle of the infield, both switch hitters, will be pretty uh, good for the team. Now, for the outfield, we are getting the fastest guy in the game, 
99 overall, Ricky Henderson, who will be, of course, leading off for our team. Get the 99 speed on base right away with that uh, ceiling threat will be fantastic. Now we're going to be getting a big lefty bat. We only have three lefties if you include the switch hitters in the team. Curtis Granderson, a very good card. 96 overall in terms of attributes. I have yet to use him, but looking forward. Uh, having him in the outfield with Ricky Henderson and also Jose Bautista will be in that outfield for the all-time Blue Jay team. Uh, now for a closing pitchers, relievers, uh, of course, Suong Oh, we got to add him as well as Roberto Suna, whose price is down because he's available in the in the seven inning program at the moment, just over 5,000 stubs. Uh, Ken Giles, he does have his life series, of course, but we're going to be getting his 86 overall diamond. So we're going to get that order for Osuna, which his life series was one of my favorite relievers in the whole game, his life series card. And now his diamond is going to be absolutely filthy. Can't wait to use him. Here, Ken Jaws, I've loved using Ken Jaws as well. I used him earlier in the year. And at one point, I had uh, multiple saves, uh, ERA close to zero. Absolutely love his card. Now starting pitchers, there's a few guys we do need to pick up. We've got to get the 95 overall. Jack Morris, as you can see in the corner, some orders are starting to come through. Uh, Jack Morris, just over 11,000 subs, 95 overall signature series. Uh, we already have a few Blue Jays in that rotation already. And last but not least, we'll be getting the 87 overall Francisco Liriano to close up the rotation. Alright guys, it has happened. We have completed every single collection, completing Mike Trout and the Los Angeles Angels. First time I've ever owned Trout, never pulled him. And the first time I'm actually going to be completing all Live Series collections with no money spent. Such a great feeling. We get Troy Percival, 85 overall uh, reliever right there. Going to be completing the AL West to get Vita Blue, who I am adding in my rotation. I do have a bit of trouble hitting him. I find his windup is a bit deceiving. Throws hard. Pretty good card over there. 93 overall. And also, we're going to be completing, of course, the American League. Herman Killebrew, Jose Bautista, and Vita Blue. We're going to get 6,000 subs, 12,500 XP. 99 Yvonne Pudge Rodriguez welcome to the squad now of course I mentioned I am doing voiceover I have played a few games uh, versus the computer in the, the moments love his card and here he is last but not least the man the legend 99 overall Willie Mays 10,000 subs 17,500 XP locking in Pudge and Rogers Hornsby we have done it guys the journey the grind is over no money spent Willie Mays has been acquired. Welcome to the team, the best card in the game. Alright guys, so here it is. My all-time Blue Jay team has been completed. Players have played for the Blue Jays previous years. Current Blue Jay as well on the bench. So we're going to start off with Russell Martin, 95 overall catcher behind the plate. Frank Thomas, of course, at first base, the big hurt. Roberto Alomar at second. Uh, there we go. Roberto Alomar, uh, diamond hitting, diamond defense. He does have the diamond badge as well. Switch hitter. Omar Vizquel, again, diamond badge, uh, switch hitter. 98 fielding. Very good infield over there. Josh Allison, 85 fielding. He'll be a gold fielder. Great hitting stats all around. Great power over 100 on both sides. Ricky Anderson, of course, uh, 99 speed stealing. The fastest guy in the game. Curtis Granderson, he does have 86 fielding. Does have pretty good power and contact versus right. Lefties, not bad as well. 79 vision. Jose Bautista, one of my favorite cards to have used all year. He does rake. Great arm strength over there at 94 in right field. Our bench is going to be Vladimir Guerrero Jr. His home run derby card, 124 power on both sides. Bo Bichette's future stars card. Edwin Encarnacion over there in the bench, 113 power versus lefties. Joe Carter, 106 power versus lefties. And I didn't need a lefty bat on the bench. We got Justice Smoke to face a righty. 89 power versus right, a switch hitter as well. So, pitching staff, 95 overall, a Jack Morris signature series card. 87 Francisco Liriano rookie card with the Twins. Marco Estrada's. 84 overall breakout card with the Milwaukee Brewers. Of course, Aaron Sanchez, a breakout Blue Jay card. And Marcus Stroman, that card just came out a few weeks ago with the signature teams. 80 overall rookie card. 
Uh, the bullpen, we have Roberto Suna is going to be our closer. Nasty card. Great pitch selection. Liam Hendricks, I have used this card a bit. Really like that card. Uh, good hits and Ks per nine. Clutch, velocity, and break. Uh, all good stats all around. Ken Giles has that fire fastball reaching 100. Uh, swung O, oh, a very good break. 96 break, 97, 96 per nines for hits and Ks. Uh, if four seam only goes to 93, but if we forget his change up 73, that is a 20 mile an hour difference. He is deceiving. Brandon Morrow, a very good fastball cutter and slider. Only three pitches, but he is effective. Uh, Brett Cecil, one of the better gold relievers in the game. 90, 95 hits and Ks per nine, 96 break. Knuckle curve is his primary pitch. And we're going to put in David Price, of course. Uh, got to have his bullpen card. I could have taken his um, starting pitching card. But I did want another good lefty in the bullpen. Aaron Loop, who just wouldn't have cut it. Wanted to have Brett Cecil and David Price lefties in the bullpen. So there is my all-time Blue Jay team, guys. Moving on, my ultimate main squad dream team. There it is, guys. Apart from my cap, all 99 signature series. So 99 overall. Signature Series, Pudge Rodriguez, one of the best catchers in the game. Great contact and vision, 84-85 power, very good fielding stats with that great arm strength, 99-96 accuracy. He's going to gun down people trying to steal. Uh, Lou Gehrig at first base, <laughs> look at those hitting stats. That is absolutely insane. Uh, Roberto Alomar, I went through him with the Blue Jays team already. My created player does have very good stats. I'm going to show you on the screen the stats with his equipment. Still trying to improve him. Josh Johnson, of course, went over him with the Blue Jay team build. Ken Griffey Jr., I do have him in left. Still got that diamond badge for fielding. Pretty much a lefty version of Willie Mays, uh, which is here. Willie Mays, you can see the stats. Very, very close. Very comparable. Uh, Tony Gwynn, I do have him there at the moment, but I am thinking of picking up that Andre Dawson card from the program once I get com completed. Uh, Hornsby, Thomas, Henderson, Duke Snyder, and Billy Williams will be our bench. We do have a lot of good options as well, of course. Mike Trout, best life series card for the best player in the league. Uh, 96 overall. Like I mentioned, Curtis Granderson. We have Matt Kemp, Kenny Lofton, Jim Edmonds. We do have a lot of good options. Of course, Harper, I've used Ichiro all year, a glitch. Um, if I'm going to go to other players, just I'm going to just go to uh, out of position, show you guys all the other cards that I have. So Jason Giambi, Gonzalez, uh, let's see, out of position. I do have Kendall for catcher, pretty good card. Uh, Rolf Kiner only used him for the bench. Eddie Matthews, of course, the GOAT. <laughs> uh, Jason Giambi, like I mentioned, Chris Davis. And let's see, uh, secondary first. Johnny Bench, I had used him quite a bit. Not a big fan of that card. I actually really like this Lucroy card uh, compared to him. Uh, so yeah, we got a, a lot of cards to work around. Let's go over uh, pitching. Bob Gibson, Kershaw, Ryan, Wainwright, Vita Blue. Once they get that 96 Cole Hamels, it'll be an entire uh, signature team starting rotation. Uh, bullpen, Billy Wagner, Trevor Hoffman. Uh, look at Billy Wagner's stats. Insane. Max out. Almost max out. Hits in case per nine. Does have max out velocity and break. Uh, Trevor Hoffman from the XP War Pass. Sergio Romo. Crazy slider. Crazy movement on that. A very good reliever. Uh, a role this champion life series. Rob Ned, Roberto Suna, and Zach Britton. One of the better team affinity. So there we go, guys. Uh, other options I have. Raleigh Fingers. Of course, Liam Hendricks. Some good cards over there, Felipe Vasquez, and for starting pitching, uh, I do have Hershiser, of course, Scott Bertolo Colon. Uh, I'm looking to get that 96 uh, Cole Hamels once it comes out with the with the program, once I get to 200 stars, looking forward to that. Uh, always looking to build, like I said, probably going to get that Dawson card eventually put in the outfield. But there it is, guys, my all-time Blue Jay and my dream team in MLB The Show 19. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you do enjoy the video, please leave a like. I would appreciate it. Subscribe if you're new for more baseball and NHL content along the way. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.